as you can see that I've got an error. The type object company dot employee has no attribute act confirm. Welcome back. In this video, we are going to discuss on how we can solve the error object has no attribute in Odoo 16. So let me show you how to solve this error. So whenever you get the error like this, that is the object has no attribute. Let me show you how to solve it. So for that, let me go to the py page here. So this is the py page and you can see the custom module. That is the company that I employ that I've defined and you are getting the error in this model. So this is the model that I've defined the company that I employ and here you can see that I've given some fields here and let me go to the custom view of my custom model that is company dot employ and here you can see that I have defined a button for this view in the form view as you can see that I've given the string of the button as confirm and I've given the button name as the act confirm and I've given the type as object so let me go to the py as you see in the py I have not defined a function for the button that I have given in the view of my custom module so you are getting the error because you have not given the function for this button that you have defined inside the view of your custom module so this means that you have not defined the button in the model of company dot employee so for that you need to define a function inside the model company dot employee in which you have given the custom view for the button so let me just uncomment this and run the code so I have just given a simple print under the function and let me go to the backend sorry UI and here in the UI let me just after running the code let me just press on confirm and now we can see the error is gone because we have defined the function in the model company.employ so let me go to the backend here you can see that the print is working here so this is how you solve the error and if you just remove this print from here and you can see that I have given some fields that is code the partner ID the phone the verified so let me just try printing a field which is not defined inside this model so let me just give it as self dot uh, name which is not defined inside the model company that I employ and let me run the code and after running the code let me go to the UI and click on the confirm button here and you can see an error that it specifies that the company company dot employee object has no attribute ver which we have given it as print here because the self will add the all values of the fields that are defined only inside the company dot employee and we are trying to print a field which is not inside the company dot employee from the self so you are getting the error as you can see that you can see it in the log that you are getting the attribute error that is the company and employee object has no attribute ver let me just change it and just give the field that is just given in the company dot employee that is phone field as you can see here that I have defined the phone field inside the company dot employee uh, let me just run the code and let me just give the number here and save it and let me just now press on confirm and you can see the phone number of the record is displayed here because we have given 
the field which is defined inside the company dot employee you can see the error is sort and you can get the value easily so this is how you solve the attribute error field doesn't belong to the object in photo 16 that's all for today thank you